in the past, I've already told you how VDM is doing much more for the country than any of the popular Nigerian pastors with huge platforms have done. This is a man who is actually doing God's work, defending the helpless and bringing justice to many in a country where they otherwise would be helpless and no one would even take the time to listen to them or to listen to their cries, where people will be mercilessly crushed by those who have the money to put the law in their pockets. And you can find that video in the link that I will leave under this video. And I want you to please watch that video. I want you to become a lover and supporter of VDM in any way that you can if you love justice and if you love fairness. And if you know that you want justice and fairness to also be your portion in this world and the portion of your descendants. Now I want you to shut your eyes for even just a minute, if even just a minute, and say a quick prayer for VDM. I want you to pray for VDM every morning when you wake up and you're saying prayers for yourself. I want you to say a prayer for VDM every night before you go to sleep. If you love justice and fairness, and if you want them to be your portion as well. Now, I want to quickly just intimate you of what has happened, just fresh off the press. In fact, you know what? The reason why I love VDM so much is, you know, this platform is about conscious empowerment. And that is what VDM is doing. You know how the country has been. You know how people have suffered. People who are unable to speak out when they are being taken advantage of. VDM has done so much in the past over a year, I think. Yeah, he's been doing this all on his own. And so what I'm going to be doing now is that every day, as much as possible, I will drop a little, I'll take out a little time on this platform to put something out here about VDM because I want him to always be on your mind. I want you to, I want to imprint him on your mind. I know that you guys are on this platform for a different thing, but in the end, it's all about conscious empowerment. So I want us to become people who are supporting him, even if it's only in spirit. Do you understand? Let's put our money where our mouths are. If you love Nigeria and you want that country to change positively, I want you to be a spiritual supporter of VDM. Right. So what has just happened? VDM has just re released a voice recording allegedly implicating Bobriski and Femi Falano, the senior advocate of Nigeria, um, a human rights activist, as well as EFCC. I want you to listen to the recording and tell me what you think. Yes, all right. In respect to Bob Risky, what I'm about to post now, um, a lot of names will be mentioned. Um, these are people that I also respect, and I believe a lot of Nigerians respect them as well. I am very, very disappointed in the agencies that are involved in this. And um, I believe that this call recording that i'm about to play even bob risky will not expect it <laughs> that is what is crazy but all the people that will be mentioned i don't care you understand i don't care and from today no longer respect for all of you you understand because all of them are the same and it's pretty obvious that in nigeria the law only work against the poor people do you understand now after this video i would expect that the efcc would do a deep investigation on everybody that is involved in this case and also they will bring the whole officers that participated in this and collected and spent this money that is involved thank you very much so i will start by playing um the call as you can see it is a call listen Papa, you know i'm a very big influencer i have over five million followers on my instagram so my facebook and they're paying me uh, on my facebook every month one so i'm okay so they were like yeah, all those money cannot still make me buy house of 450 million and pain up and we are staying in a chevron blah 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 the shop puts the money laundry share they charge me to court so when they charge me to court we have to beg them that okay if they want to remove the money laundry how much would they collect they said we should go and bring 15 million uh, that they will remove the money laundry. Now, this is one part of the video. A lot of things will be unveiled. First things first, you heard it from Bob Risky. Um, EFCC charged them, charged him 15 million naira to remove the money laundry charge that was charged against him. 
if you remember when this case against Bobriski starts, there was a money laundry charge, but from nowhere they removed, they dropped the money laundry charge. So obviously, Bobriski paid EFCC 15 million naira to remove the money laundry charge. It's crazy that EFCC claim that they are fighting against financial crime. Do you understand? But they are deeply involved in financial crime. So they remove the money laundry. Anyways, let's continue. There's a lot of things in this um, call recording. To my friend, I called my friend, you know, because I can't use my account. I wanted to send money from my account, but he said I'm still under investigation. I cannot withdraw from my account. So I now called a few of my friends. You know, Polanco, LLA. Mm -hmm. That Polanco, yeah, is my very good friend. So I called him. I told him. He was like, ah, no, I can't want to send the whole I can't want to send the whole he now gave me, I gave him my brother's account. He now sent 8 million naira. Wait, he had only sent the same year. Yeah. I was even shocked that he can send that kind of amount of money. He said, I'm uh, going to get in here a very nice person. So I called Demola. Demola in New York. He is my friend too. Mm -hmm. Demola sent 1 million naira. Because I had to call the people I'm close to, people I trust. Absolutely. The Mola sent me one million. Yeah, the Mola sent me one million immediately. Transferred one million to my account. Then I called other few people because I can't start making call because I, I don't know who set me up. So let me not start calling the the wrong people. Do okay, you understand? Sure. Uh, so I called the people I trust. So the, the money share complete fifteen million. I paid. Then I remove money laundry. Then I took me to court for spraying of money okay. and i know that the so you heard him after i paid the money to efcc efcc removed money laundry and they now removed that charge and took him for spraying money do you understand so efcc you people collect money to drop charges this is crazy and these are the people that want to fight for financial crime. Tomorrow night, you're going to tell us you will arrest Ayabelu. Are we sure that if you arrest him, you will not collect money for dropping charges? Wow. EFCC. This is crazy. But anyways, it doesn't end here. Let's continue. The old things, the old things started from, the old things started from when they gave me best female dress. You saw that video, I mean, that they gave me best female dress. Yes. That's yes, when the yes, old I things, did. yeah. Yeah, that's when the old days started from, you know, jealousy, everything. Mm, so mm. we shall we shall have got to court. I shall have told them that I'm guilty that ah, maybe because we even pity me or say, Oh yeah, pay fine. I know. Or or community service. Sadly, the court sentenced me. So you know, I was on my way to the prison, then my godfather called me. And said, You will not enter that prison. Don't worry. Let me make arrangements for an apartment close to the prison. That is going to call the um, is going to call the controller in my that's overall in Nigeria and Abuja and I'm talk to them. The shall talk before I come back, shall they not took me to one apartment that I must not come out till I finish my sentence. That's that the um, that okay. The other said, said they should come and keep me here. That I mustn't, um, I mustn't go like enter data, but nobody should know that I'm not there. Yes. You know? So they said the guy will call him money. They wanted to give them seven. Wait, 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 wait. Who is this Bob Risky's godfather that called the controller general of prison in Abuja? and instructed him that he should not let Bobriski to enter prison. And the controller general of prison now gave Bobriski an apartment outside the prison. Do you understand? An apartment outside the prison that he should act, he should stay there and he will not enter the prison. So Bobriski didn't go to prison, obviously. Basically, the prison, obviously, is for the poor men and for the poor masses. So this is how the EFCC come and lie to us. Say they don't probe somebody, they don't arrest one big man for financial crime. But they go no go arrest the man, they no go sentence him or carry him. Go give him one law somewhere and he no go enter prison. This is what is going going on in Nigeria. Do you understand? The law is only against the common and the poor man. Now the poor man they go prison. But Bobriski, one godfather somewhere. That godfather you go come out and the controller of prisons, the controller general of prisons. 
You have to come out and defend this. If not, me, I will continue rubbishing your name online, the Controller General of Prisons. So, this is how they call you to remove prisoners, eh? After the court have sentenced the prisoner, you will remove them. But that's not all. Let's continue. Like millionaire, I had to call Eli Lee again because there's nobody for me to call. Eli gave me, um, give me one, uh, two million, the balance of two million. So now the, so I'm supposed to come out in, um, I'm supposed to come out in what's it called? Ending of July next month. Okay. Twenty nine. Okay. His father is a is a son, so first reach out to me. His father spoke to me. His father said we can apply for pardon. Okay. That pardon the president because you know it's wait. Faust the bad guy. I can't even believe this. Faust the bad guy contacted Bob Risky. and Femi Falano contacted his father, and his father Femi Falano spoke to Bob Risky. In order to divert justice, and this same files, if this story is true, this same files, we have the audacity to come out and say he's fighting against the governments for oppression. That he wants justice, he wants Nigeria to be better. So that like this, you they carry yourself. I don't want to believe that Femi Falano will bring himself down to this level. A whole Femi Falano, where be Femi lawyer, where we respect Femi Falano, will engage himself in something like this. Wait, 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 what is the relationship between Faus and Bobriski? I mean, Faus said they do. Oh, okay. Who are we to crucify the homosexual? Most of them don't they evolve from time. Everybody is a motherfucking hypocrite, though. No, oh, now that song they make sense to me. Wait, I mean, Faus said they do. This is crazy. Well, anyways, let's continue. Hey, now wow, Nigeria. Uh, it's okay. federal that uh, my 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 case is federal. That's so that the federal can actually pardon me. That's the president that mm -hmm. he can do it. That I, if, it, if they pardon me, I can even leave here by next week. Do you understand? I don't have to wait till like uh, ending of next month. Okay. okay. So the man started the pardon. He said he wants to send it to the uh, minister, minister of justice in Abuja. So Minister of Justice will now send it to President to approve it. But you know Nigeria now, Nigeria with the corruption and everything, you take it fast to him. That the man, they have said they will collect 10 million naira for him to get. That that pardon will clear my name off the record. Of the record, which is not yes. bad. That which exactly. So... You know, there's nobody to call because, like, I have friends, so, but, you know, you don't know who set you up, you know, and they've not opened my account. All right, so based on this first voice note, based on Bobriski's narration in this uh, phone call, Bobriski is saying that Femi Falano collected 10 million Naira in order to wipe his name off the record. Wow! These are people I respected. These are people I look up to. Faust the bad guy always talking about yeah I'm speaking up for the people. So you are also involved in things like this. It's really really disappointing. It's obvious that Nigeria might not go anywhere anytime soon. It's obvious. Say Nigeria, no, I have lost 100% respect, respect for this. Unless if they come and come defend this one, saying a lie. But for now, uh, we we'll take what Bobriski is saying as the truth because Bobriski said all these things like he contacted. Uh, somebody to borrow him money and the person recorded everything now uh, just in case uh, Bob Risky go on argue let me drop your number uh, this is your number eh? now nah, why are... so this is your number your number ends with uh, 2208 that's what your number ends with so this is you actually you cannot deny anything so EFCC I will expect you people to bring to do a deep investigation and bring all the people involved to the dumb out of justice if you know you truly fight against financial crime and this particular crime went deep down inside your own custody and it's really crazy and the controller general of prison i don't know i don't know what's it happened but it's almost as if yes i want to know the godfather 
and why the controller of prison allowed them instead of putting Bobriski in a correctional facility they took him and gave him a lodge outside the prison i don't know that is allowed i didn't know that was allowed but anyways there are more videos to come do you understand this is just part one first part one we'll see where part two they be don't play <laughs> you gotta learn and you will learn the hard way i don't care don't play i said it so that's vidm playing his role in consciously empowering nigerians and nigeria what do you think about this i get worried about him and that's why i'm asking you to pray because I know that evil, evil people do not like what he's doing. I know they hate what he's doing. And you can already imagine that he does have enemies. So let's spiritually empower him as much as we can. Now leave your thoughts in the comments. May God bless and protect VDM.